On Fox tonight, another round of flooding hits the Quad Cities. That is tonight's top story. The Mississippi River crested again today, forcing crews to shut down parts of River Drive and Davenport. It comes as some people are still dealing with receding floodwaters from the Rock River. Fox 18 Sahara Rockman joins us in the studio with what one neighbor is saying tonight. Tahara. Eric Jim Getch has seen historic flooding on the Mississippi River back in 1993 and of the Rock River in 2013. And although we haven't broken those records yet this year, he has seen a few other firsts this, this past year and took us up in the air for a bird's eye view of flood damage so far. Jim Getch has been flying in the Quad Cities for more than 50 years. He's seen these views completely covered by water. Oh yeah, no, this is not the worst flood we've ever had. But even he has come across some firsts over the past year. We never had an October flood before. We had that and then we had the one in February with the ice that really messed things up to where you couldn't get in and out because it floated everything up and then it froze again. So we had to fight the ice. Getch has also lived along the Rock River for 41 years and says rising waters are becoming more frequent on both the Rock and Mississippi rivers. I've seen three and four years we didn't have a flood, but the last few years we have had a lot more floods. That means more post-flood cleaning and recovery. What I got to do when this all goes down is I go in and I uh, take a squeegee and push the mud up and spread it out someplace and then I'll take my pressure washer and bleach and scrub and clean. While he hopes there aren't any more neighborhood cleanups anytime soon, Getch says he knows Mother Nature might have different plans. You always hope no, but the weather's been goofy anymore, so it's kind of hard to tell. Now the Mississippi River is expected to fall back from major to moderate flood stage later this week, but our Fox 18 meteorologists say we could be looking at the worst flood ever in the Quad Cities within the next month or so. In the studio, Tahira Rahman, Fox 18 News.